Nairobi residents have been urged to give their views on the proposed finance bill of 2018 that seeks to raise taxes and rates before the public participation period lapses tomorrow. The governor says the proposals, which include increased parking and garbage collection fees, will only be implemented if the majority of residents back them up. NTV's Brenda Wanga reports. It's lunch hour in the CBD Nairobi and a handful of people have gathered around a makeshift pulpit. For one hour, they will listen as evangelists and your ministers to them, feeding their souls. This isn't a free service, though. The evangelist says every hour she preaches, the county government earns money from her and others like her. The years are 750, it's 1,000. At the end of the service, she collects offerings from her flock, but she says she barely breaks even. This activity is a sum of the areas that the county government is seeking to tap into to show up its revenues. If the proposals as contained in the proposed finance bill 2018 of the Nairobi county government are adopted, then it will cost the daytime preachers twice as much per hour to access and use this facility in the CBD. Currently, daytime loan preachers part with 500 shillings to preach at the Central Park, Jivanji and City Park. The county will now charge one 1,000 shillings for the same. It isn't the only avenue the county government is planning to use to squeeze more money out of the city's taxpayers. If the proposals are passed, it will cost the taxpayer 500 shillings, up from 400, to have the carcasses of small animals like hen, cats, and pigs collected by the county government. The carcasses of bigger animals like cows, donkeys, horses, and camels will attract a collection charge of 5,000 shillings, up from the current 4,000. But perhaps the most pain should be felt by the low-income earners who will now pay the county government 100 shillings every month to have the county collect garbage from their homes. Middle income earners will pay 300 shillings while the high end suburb dwellers will pay 500 shillings to have the county do its work. The pain of the increase in rates is also expected to reflect on the roads. Parking charges for both private and commercial vehicles are also set to increase. The county government is seeking to increase its revenue collection to plug in the 7 billion shillings deficit and its ambitious 34 billion shillings budget. The efforts coming on the back of reduced revenue collections of 8.8 .8 billion shillings this year as compared to the same period last year when the county collected 9.8 billion shillings. Brenda Wanga. And TV.